Hello and welcome to the Rambling Man Camp Food Taste Test. Yet again, in a bovvy, this is the Chalk Memorial Bovvy uh, near Poskiak in uh, Dumfries and Galloway on the Southern Lutner Way. And it's the third bovvy of six on the route. And I'm staying here tonight because the weather has been absolutely raining, wet, wet drenched hole in this last few days. So I see uh, sleeping outside on damp, horrible, muddy land is in particular my radar. So I'm in here and I'm going to be cooking up some food in a bit. And this is what we're on tonight. Wow, it's batches, pasta and sauce, uh, cheese and leek and ham flavour. Um, this I picked up for about £1.35 or something like that in a um, uh, branch of spa yesterday. And has some benefits because it's 120 grams. It's very light. It's lighter than the uh, travel lunches I've had so far, and about a third the price. Uh, on the other hand, yeah, unlike the travel lunches, I'm not quite sure on the uh, quality of ingredients. Um, I mean, <coughs> this is you know, obviously cheese, so it's got cheese powder, 4.5%. Okay, leek. Ooh, yeah, leek. Um, Leek. Ah, yes, it is. Dried leek, 0.8%. Okay. And ham flavour. Yes, yeah, see, there we go. Ham flavour. There's no ham in this at all. Not even freeze dried ham. Nothing at all. Um, but never mind. It's, uh, it's going to do. It's um, quite easy to make, but um, will it taste any good? Let's find out. So it's a bit dark in this uh, bobby, unfortunately. Uh, I'll try just to show you. This is inside the packet. It's the pasta walls. And on the stove here we have um, uh, 300 millilitres of water and 125 millilitres of milk. Well, that's what it's supposed to be. Um, it's powdered milk that I've used here. Uh, and we're going to put our pasta rolls into our milk sauce. So I'll put that. Oops, it's very hard to do this uh, and hold a camera and one hand at the same time, it has to be said. There we go. There we go. And we've got this flickering away there, because just see that. Do -do -do. So, what we have to do, if I can find my solutions, uh, place in a saucepan and bring to the boil. Ah, then that's doing the pack contents. Whoops, never mind. <laughs> um, let's see what I've not got my implements sorted out properly here. Oh well, so I'm going to uh, bring that to the boil and then stir in my ingredients. Because <coughs> we haven't done that yet. Um, so I'm just going to stir all this in now. Anyway. Uh, that looks really good, doesn't it? Uh, I'm, I'm sure once that's boiling, it'll all go smoothly and swimmingly. Well, here we go. This is just about um, <clears throat> done cooking. Uh, it says the pasta sauce will thicken on standing. It doesn't really seem to be doing that. But anyway, let's see how it goes. Um, Mm. Mm. Um. Well. Hmm. Well, if that's supposed to be a cheese sauce, um, I'd hate to know what their idea of cheese is. It just tastes kind of it's a bit, um, well, kind of watery actually. Um. <clears throat> As for the ham, well, there's a kind of vaguely hamish flavour in there, but it, it's very vague, very um, very chemical. It's so saucy. I'm going to use a spoon, I think. <laughs> um, what can we say? It's a bit. Whoops. <laughs> Bit like eating nothing. So 
So there you have it. It may be widely available, but uh, bachelor's pastoral sauce, cheese leek and ham flavour. <clears throat> well, where is the flavour? I think is the, the serious question. Um, if bachelors are watching, my recommendation is put more leek in. What little leek is in there actually does give a bit of a nice powerful taste. But it's not enough of it to actually make any difference. <coughs> so, it may be 120 grams. It may be quite easy on the road and on your rucksack and in your pocket. But there's probably better things you can eat. Well, it's got to be said that that uh, meal was so depressing. I'm going to do something I've not done at all since starting doing these camp food taste tests. I'm going to have dessert. Okay, maybe only be a Snickers bar, but frankly, be a lot more tasty than that. Bachelors, if you're watching, sort it out.